I have, I have a, a confession. confession. I have this insatiable addiction to coffee. Fair trade coffee. Fair trade coffee and NPR membership mugs. I want to wake up to that smell next to me, that and freshly pressed New Yorkers, and moleskin covers, and sweaty yoga mats. See, the truth is, I'm, I'm a, a snow queen. queen. I just have this, this thing. For, for white, white people. people. <laughs> Can't help it. It's the way they eat steak for dinner. Mm. I know I'm a vegetarian, but I would make exceptions. I've heard that white men have huge... Empires. I've heard they're really good at... Gentrification. Once, a white woman asked me where I was from. No, where I was really from. Then she told me that she was going to India with her nonprofit that year. And I said, oh, tell me more. Oh, take me with you. The first white boy I slept with was so excited when I told him he was sexy. Like, I was the first person to say that. Like, ever in the entire world. You have to understand, I like it that way. Like, your veins are showing. Like, your skin could bleach out your clothes. Like, your SPF level is 9,000. Like, white. It, it just, just turns me, me on. on. Like, I would love to cuddle in the ugliest sweaters with you and listen to David Sedaris and plan our future lives together. We can rent one apartment in Brooklyn and the other in the Mission and stare at the same chase-shaped constellations together at nighttime. I want you to pick me up on the way back from your unpaid internship. I want to jam in your Prius to your hip-hop. I want you to tell me more about your gap year. I want to map the lines on your palms to the lines you drew in Africa. I want to get my name tattooed on your arms in Sanskrit and then in Chinese. I want us to make black friends together. I want us to have brunch with them. I just, I just want us to get gay married in San Francisco. I want to pick up our travel print tuxedos together at American Apparel. I want to vote for Obama with you and name our ethnically adopted children, Hope and Post Race. On our wedding night, you will tell me about all the women of color artists that make you feel like a diva, such as Beyonce, and you will awkwardly gyrate me without your hips. Later that night, you will pull me aside and take nude photos of me, like that time you randomly selected me from the airport security check line. I, I love that. And when we're couch surfing together on our first honeymoon night, I will call you master, because colonialism never had a safe word. And you will whisper tenderly in my ear, Don't worry, I'm not racist like them. Then, then fuck me, like you are. are.